Sharon Jern and welcome to my Biz Blitz video. Today, I want to tell you to stop, stop creating more content. I see coaches come to me into my program and they're creating more content, more content, more content, more content, and nothing's happening with it. And they get into this stuck mode or procrastination because they feel like they need to create more content without really having a purpose for doing it. So firstly, if you're creating content, allow people time to absorb it. Sometimes it takes prospective clients um, three, four, five, nine times um, seeing it before they will take action. So make sure that you're giving people time to get your message. Secondly, Give it to more people. I see people, uh, coaches, creating content, but they're only sharing out with half a dozen people. So make sure that in different um, locations, like in different um, speaking engagements or workshops, you can deliver the same content because you've got a different audience. Thirdly, repurpose your content. Do a video, make it a blog, do a transcription, an email out. Um, all of these areas where you can repurpose your content, make sure that you're covering off on these areas and um, sharing it out with the masses because some people will watch your video, some people will uh, read your blog and you want to make sure you're getting in front of those people. So stop creating more content. <laughs> Firstly, before you do, uh, the, my three points are allow people to absorb it, uh, give it to more people and give it often and repurpose. If you want to find out more about how you create content and how you utilize that in a very productive way, come along to my Grow Your Coaching Biz workshop and you, I will share all of the strategies around growing your business around content. So I'd love to see you there. Thank you for watching my video today. If this has been of value to you, please share it out with your friends, family and colleagues because I want to help as many people as I can and I'd love your help to do that. I'm Sharon Jurd and we'll talk soon.